Hello everybody, Minister here. Welcome back to Workers and Resources, Soviet Republic. In the last episode, uh, we got our concrete uh, finished, uh, set up, and we are exporting the, not concrete, cement, cement to the border. So that's good. That'll bring in a little bit more extra cash uh, that we can use to build stuff. And yeah, then we got to work on a new industry, which is going to be an oil industry. We have an oil field over here. So we began installing pump jacks to exploit the oil field and uh, set up storage tanks for them and uh, built a gas power plant and an oil refinery. And so we're going to be plumbing all this stuff in more and uh, setting up a small town here to be able to feed workers into these uh, this industry. So that's a plan. I threw in a few roads over here uh, because uh, this needed some roads. So that's good. We also have our trolley bus. Trolley bus stops. So that... Uh, Kind of where we're getting started here. And so I just got to figure out how all this is all going to get connected. So, well, I think one of the first things we're going to need to do here is we need to bring power over from the existing power lines. Now, we have a high voltage switch here, but it only goes that way. So we're going to need another high voltage switch over here. That'll only turn off the power there for a second. Alright. High voltage switch. Actually, what I should do... Just throwing some dirt road there, just in case. I was noticing the, the, the trees I planted have uh, grown in fairly nicely there. We'll probably do some more planting of trees. Why not? We also should be able to get a fairly decent uh, logging industry going here as well, given how many trees we've got in the area. But that'll be for, uh, for later. For now, my goal is to be able to build my own asphalt roads is what the, the ultimate hope is here so that's not medium voltage high voltage we're going to go with the maximum wattage yeah we're just going to kind of bring this through do you want to mm. Yeah, we're going to need a switch about here. Ah, there goes a bunch of our trees. It's all right. Now drop in the switch there. A transformer. Now yeah, we can drop it in right about there. Eat it. All right, excellent. 
Now, we need to run power into the Trotho. And we need to run power into some substations. Electric substations. We'll probably want two. I'm going to go off that intersection in case I want to use that intersection. All right. Hold on. I'm going to bring this out like this and then route it in there. There we go. I could have gone underground with that, but it's all right. I kind of want to save the cash right now. Slide that substation in there. And then we can run power off of there. And that'll provide power to our pump jacks. Excellent. I need another substation over here. Uh, you are getting your power, right? Yeah, you're getting power. All right, good. Right. Then we just need a substation here. That will do for now. All right, more high voltage wiring. That's high voltage, I believe. I guess you don't have any actual medium voltage. Did I just hook directly into there? No, I wouldn't want to do that. And we are going to want to hook into there, right? We're going to want to put a switch in. Probably right about there. Gonna switch in here. We're gonna need another switch over here. And a transformer. All right. And then substation they can provide power to all those pump jacks actually I'd like to get all the pump jacks if I can I don't think I can get all of them all right then
And we'll rework where those power lines actually go. As needed. Alright, everybody's got power. Good. And we're starting to fill up with oil. Excellent. It's not coming in very fast, is it? Four and a half tons of oil a day. Okay. It's a start. Okay, let's pause it up here. And I think... This corner is kind of where we're going to start building our town. We're going to put in a trolley bus stop. Is that relatively straight? It's sort of. All right, so as far as residential buildings, you want like big apartment buildings? What's, what's the mod? Forty-four workers, hundred and ninety-eight workers. Two hundred and seventy workers on that thing. this I don't know if I necessarily want to go that large I mean if we go with this it's about the same size as this building Let's, just, let's go with these. Let's go with a couple of them to start with. Actually, let's see if I can put in a road first. Kind of serve as a little bit of a guide. Probably about as good as I'm going to get.
Does the grid help me at all here? Not really. Drop it in. Alright, so down this road. We want to do it over here. I think we'll do it over here. The stuff we're going to need. We're going to need shopping center has meat, clothes, electronics. Yeah, yeah, we'll go with the shopping center right on the corner. And a pub. Because, of course. And the cinema. Alright, now, is there actual, like, um, substation anywhere near enough to this? Um, no, I don't think so. It's all right. We, we, we can, we can sort of make this work. Where can I sneak the substation in? I guess we'll put the substation in right next to the, the cinema. And where would be the best? See, there's there's a transformer over there. And there's a transformer over there. But I think for this, we're going to go um, underground. Just for convenience. All right. Now, the other thing we're going to need to do here is we're going to need uh, a kindergarten and a school. Um... here. I think, for the time being, what we're going to do... Well, we're going to need... A trolley bus depot. That's going to have to get put in here. Oh, we need to put the tro hook the trofo up. Ah, uh, right.
It'll do. Oh, that's not going to work. Yeah, yeah, we need, we need the electrical connection. All right. So. Give me four of these trolley buses. And... What is the route going to look like? Start here. Go there. Come back to here. And go there. I think that'll do. And then we get on the line details. We turn on the line spacing. Once it is able to calculate out its the line length, it will then space the, the buses out properly. Uh, let's see, workers without a job. Oh yeah. Lots of students in the classroom. I think we are actually going to need more. More of these. Now, here's what I'm going to want to do. I want to leave a little bit of space there. I want a footpath to come through here. And come through there. Connect to there. Now, the other thing we're probably going to need out here is this place's own yeah, equipment for citizens. Its own fire department. Right? And its own hospital. Uh, how are you confused? Yeah, that would probably present the problem, wouldn't it? There we go. A bit messy right now, but eventually we'll ha we'll have this running a, a bigger loop. But it should work fine for now. <coughs> All right, 
We're gonna need some mechanisms. New vehicle. Let's go with, um, those are good ambulances. Yeah, there we go. And over here, we're going to need some stuff as well. We're going to need a couple fire trucks, a ladder, and I guess that's like a pump. There we go. I should probably also throw in a footpath. Going there. I think I put that a little bit too close. It's alright. All right, now we have workers, but it has no oil. So now we just gotta start figuring out where the oil is gonna go. Um, does any have any workers managed to get out there? Five hundred workers can work in this place. Yikes. Okay. And here's what we're gonna do. We need to throw in some. Single in multi out pipes or pumps. We're going to, have to go underground, I think, with this. All right, excellent. Yeah, we're, we're, we're sucking the, the oil out of there. Are we using it? The number is going up, which means we are producing it at a rate that is more than that thing uses it. Okay, that's good. All right, now, here is where what would be nice is a multi-in, multi-out pump. I think I could probably... Well, no, these actually have multiple outs. Okay. Okay, yeah, that, that will work. And we need to make sure that it has power. So, yeah, there we go. Underground pipe is going to have to go from there to there. starting to build up your oil you're producing fuel and bitumen all right excellent so now what are your outputs 
Our outputs are over here. All right, it's cool. Well, and here's what we're gonna do. Put in the dirt road for the moment. No, infrastructure, fuel uh, storage. We're gonna drop in a tank here. Don't necessarily want the tanks to be connected, no. They can out that way, they can out that way, good, okay. I want you to store fuel. And I want you to store bitumen. Yikes. Okay. That's fine. Underground pipe is really handy. All right, so now you should be storing fuel. Yes, you should be storing bitumen. Um, did I put pumps? I don't think so. we're consuming everything we're producing as far as oil goes. Alright. The other thing, I need to do research to make chemical plants. Ooh. Electricity problem. Problem with one of my buildings, there's no electricity to the building. Why is there no electricity to the building? Probably. Because the only power that it can do is off of this thing, and this thing has no workers. Oh, lovely. Okay. Um, not a problem. We can throw in a substation. Now you have power. There we go. Do you have workers? You do not have workers. Oh yeah, sport. Right. You need something to do, I guess.
Can't build due to infrastructure. Can't, can't squeeze it in there? Uh, who? Oh, no, I can squeeze it in this way. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Okay, you now have some sport that you can participate in. And it seems that they are in fact participating in sport. Good. You're not taking any workers. Ambulance. So apparently the emergency vehicles can get to these buildings. That's good. That was a slight concern. There's a reason why the other buildings have road connections is so that the emergency vehicles can get to them. At least as far as I understand, anyway. Oh, and we are we're running long here. So I gotta figure out why we're not getting any workers over here. Oh, now we're getting some workers. Okay, maybe it was just because that thing was out of power and therefore nobody could go to it. And now that it has power, now that it can now it can actually function. Okay, that, that's fine. All right, so we will go ahead and stop here for the day. No workers. Either we need more residential buildings, or we need more trolley buses. Probably both. All right, well. Yeah, as I said, we'll stop here for today, and we'll uh, work some more on this when we come back. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.